to the mayor's blog. Uh, today was the first day that we begun Occupy the Schools. It was over 100 men and different schools and, and ladies and different high schools around the city of Newark welcome our, welcoming our kids to school, but at the same time talking to them, letting them know that we care about them, we love them, we embrace them, uh, we want to direct them, mentor them, so that they don't uh, go down a trajectory that leads them to a life of, of, of crime and, and, and destituteness, but a, a life of success, of happiness, uh, of outstanding opportunities, and we are going out, uh, I, I believe the first week of every month, uh, to begin to welcome our kids to school. And we need you to continue to be involved in that. I just want to say thank you to all of the uh, men and women that participated this morning. It was an incredible sight to see uh, over at Central Shabazz, Weekway, Barringer, everywhere where we were. Uh, I'm sure the kids were excited. The principals were excited. Uh, the community uh, is excited. We are about to take charge of our own neighborhoods. And ultimately, that's how we transform our city as we begin to take charge of our communities, take charge of our schools, our families, our neighborhoods. Uh, and once we do that and not leave it to other individuals to do for us, we begin to pull ourselves up uh, and, take care, and take care of our own communities, our own neighborhoods. We see the transformation happening right before our very eyes. And so I need everybody uh, involved in that. You know, as much time as we spend talking about the violence that takes place in the city, the negative things that takes place in the city. I want you to begin to talk about the positive things that are happening in Newark, how we helping each other, how we need to get together and rebuild our community, how you saw 30, 40, uh, you know, black and brown men and women in front of schools uh, today, uh, welcoming kids, talking to kids, mentoring kids. We need that, and we need you to be a part of that. I mean, there's, there's something else, uh, a last piece that I, I want to touch on. You know, I read an article that said that, uh, that was talking about Black Lives Matter that said that we talk a lot about the police violence on us and not about the violence uh, that we uh, do to each other. First, I just want to say that I don't think that that's true. All over the country, there are community organizations and groups like here in Newark, Newark Anti-Violence Coalition, for years that have been speaking out against violence, that have been doing things about the violence, that have been in schools, that have been in after-school programs, been in the jails, been in the youth house, go to these blocks where the murders take place. Uh, and have rallies and talk to families uh, who always speak out about the violence that takes place in our community. And this is just not germane to Newark. It happens in Chicago and Detroit and in New Orleans and New York and California. You know, these organizations uh, every single day speak out loudly against the epidemic of violence that's taking place uh, in our communities and our neighborhoods. So we let's not confuse the two. Black Lives Matter. Uh, we don't want anybody taking our lives, whether it be at the hands of law enforcement or at the hands of people that look like us in our communities. So all that needs to stop. And I think a positive way to for us to begin to push in the other direction is be a part of this Occupy the Schools. Be a part of Occupy the City, Occupy the Block. Be a part of that. Uh, the mayor, myself, me, and I, with a whole bunch of other people, we are organizing uh, what's called our world tour. And we went to every high school. We went to Delaney Hall. We go into the youth house on Wednesday, the juvenile detention center. We go into the county jail. We go into Northern State. We go into everywhere uh, where we are to talk to our kids about life, love, and empowerment, and not death and destruction. We need you to be a part of that. We need you to talk life into our kids and not death. We need you to raise positivity on your social media, not negativity on your social media. Don't use it as an opportunity to gossip and destroy each other. Use it as an opportunity to spread the good word and lift each other up. To promote building and, 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 and love and the development of our community and our city. Because all of us together, we are Newark. And only us as a collective can transform our city. God bless you.